400 years ago, on the 14th of May, 1606, Pedro Fernando de Quiros, a Portuguese explorer, landed in the New Hebrides, searching for the great southern continent. It was on these shores that he made an incredibly significant proclamation concerning our nation, that all the lands to the south of where he stood be declared the great south lands of the Holy Spirit. He marked Vanuatu with a cross and he dedicated these nations and he said, these nations shall be evangelized with the gospel of Jesus Christ. I believe that is beginning to take place as never before. This profound statement is part of Australia's unique godly heritage. We are a unique and culturally diverse nation and despite the many trials and hardships we have experienced, we are a blessed nation. You know, being an Australian is such a privilege. There are so many great things about our country, but to know that God has prophesied that we are going to be the great Southland of the Holy Spirit, to know that the Lord has declared that the greatest move in the last days will come out of our country, New Zealand, is extraordinary. We are so privileged and yet we have such a great responsibility to walk with Him in these hours and in these days. Smith Wigglesworth in the 1930s came to New Zealand and Australia and he prophesied that the greatest outpouring in the history of mankind would take place in New Zealand, Australia, and the Polynesian Islands. I believe that we are on the brink of a great outpouring in the Southern Hemisphere. I believe that the Spirit of God is sweeping throughout the nations, and in this side of the world, the Spirit of God is moving in a powerful way. Over the last eight to 10 years, we've had the privilege of great men of God coming to our country, of sowing into us the possibilities of what God could do with us. People like Bill Johnson, Graham Cook, Randy Clark, Cheyenne, the Bakers, Roland and Heidi, they've all come and inspired us. We are seeing miracles and healings in local churches like we've never seen before. Across Australia and New Zealand, there is an excitement in God's people about who they could be for the Lord and how heaven could invade earth through them in their workplaces, their schools, their universities and in their neighbourhoods. It is an extraordinary time to be alive and we are just looking forward to so much more than we're already experiencing. Now, I'm just so excited that there is going to be a wonderful move of the Holy Spirit here in Australia and New Zealand. And I'm so pleased to say that as the Regional Director, we have staff and volunteers in our office in Melbourne, and we have camera guys that we work with all over this great nation to capture what God's doing for God TV. And I'm just excited, and I'm getting ready, and I encourage you to get ready. Get ready, get ready, get ready. And just like Smith Wigglesworth said, I believe we're going to see the latest and the greatest move of the Holy Spirit here in Australia and New Zealand. 